Before you give or take the next dose of Lasix, here are three things you need to know. Hello everyone, it's Nosmo from Rofem. Let's talk about Lasix, also known as furosemide. It is one of the most common diuretics or water pills. Furosemide is powerful and it can be life-saving, but you need to pay attention. Furosemide works by telling your kidneys to dump excess water and salt. This will reduce fluid overload, swelling, and blood pressure. That is why it is commonly ordered for conditions like heart failure, hypertension, and kidney disease. After a person starts taking Lasix, their weight will usually go down in a couple of days. Safety is very important, so pay attention to these three safety checks. Number one, check blood pressure. Lasix can quickly lower blood pressure. That's hypotension. Remember, low volume, low pressure. So you will need to monitor closely for dizziness, fainting, or even signs of shock. Number two, check electrolyte levels. Water is not the only thing furosemide will take out of the body. This medication will get rid of electrolyte like potassium, sodium, and magnesium. Low potassium can affect the heart and lead to dangerous cardiac rhythms. It is important for nurses to check lab values. And if you are a patient on Lasix, take your supplements or eat potassium-rich diet as ordered by your doctor. Number three, check kidney function. Furosemide works on the kidneys. If the kidneys are already not doing good, giving Lasix can put more pressure on the kidneys and that may not end well. Therefore, pay attention to creatinine levels, urine output, and watch for signs of dehydration. So what are the side effects of Lasix? Urinary urgency and frequency is expected after a person takes Lasix, especially if the dose is given IV because it will start working within minutes. You also need to watch for dizziness, low blood pressure, and electrolyte imbalances. If you are a patient taking Lasix, it is very important for you to stand up slowly to avoid orthostatic hypotension. Thank you so much for watching and learning from this video. Like, share, and subscribe to stay updated. If you have any questions, you can drop them in the comment section. See you next time.